guys today i'm gonna be showing you how i do my sweet chili prawns i'm using the king prawns in the shell so i'm gonna first of all i'm gonna cut off some of these i don't like too much of these things so i'm just gonna cut some off Yes, guys, I'm getting rid of all this. Too much of these little things sticking out. I don't like it, so I'm just going to get rid of some of it. Yes, guys, I've taken all of the strings. I've cut off most of it. There's some left, but I can, I can work with that. I'm just gonna wash it now with some vinegar. As you know, I only use sarsens. So I'm gonna add some in there. You can also use lemon juice, but I'm, I just like to use my vinegar. I'm using cold water. I don't wanna use, you don't use warm water when you're doing this, you use, you use cold water. So I'm just washing it over and over in about three, four times to get the vinegar out of it my prawn is nice and clean I'm gonna show you my seasoning I'll be using some of this but I'll strain it off I won't use everything I'll strain it and use my sweet and sour I'll be using my Maggie fish seasoning I'll be using a little bit of honey. I'll be using pimento seed, the whole pimento. I'll be using sweet chili. I like to mix them both, so but it doesn't matter. You can just use one, but I like to mix these two. I'll also be adding a little bit of Maggi all-purpose and to my black pepper. So guys, I'm gonna add my powder seasoning. I'm adding some fish seasoning as I showed you before I'm adding a little bit of my Maggi you don't want to add too much because it's not too much um, prawns and you don't want it to be salt I'm adding my pimento seeds as you know pimento seeds give a very good flavor I'm also going to add some black pepper I'm adding a little bit of black pepper and to be honest I'm going to add some garlic powder forgot to tell you about my, the garlic powder a little bit of garlic powder garlic is very good on seafood so I'm adding a little bit of garlic powder and I'm gonna mix these in make sure your hands are clean and I'm gonna just leave this to marinate not for long I'm just gonna leave this to marinate for a little while maybe about 20 minutes then I'll come back and show you I'm guys I just had my thyme it's already washed my scallion and I'm gonna add this pepper in. I'm just gonna leave it, as I said, for 20 minutes, only 20 minutes, and I'll come back and show you guys how it's done. Yes, guys, I'm back. This is my next step. I'm adding a bit of coconut oil in the pot with my scotch bonnet pepper, for as you know, it's sweet chili. So if you like a lot of spice, you can add more pepper, but I'm just adding the amount I want. I'm going to add my prawns along with my ingredients that I showed you earlier. And you know when you are cooking prawns, they will go pink, they change in color. So I'm just going to leave it for a while. So, here it is guys. They all turn pink. I've strained half of this. I've strained half of this in a, in a little bowl because I don't want the bits in it, so I just need the sauce. So here is it. I've strained it, so I'm just gonna add it. I'm gonna add it to the prawns. 
and cover it for a while. So after three minutes, I'm adding two tablespoons each of the sweet chili sauce. Remember, I use two different types. So I use two tablespoons each and I'm adding it to that. I'm going to add a little bit of garlic powder. I'm also going to add one tablespoon of honey. One big tablespoon of honey. A little bit of maggi, not a lot, just a little bit. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to add a little piece of maggi for shrimp. Just a little piece, I don't want too much. And just a little tip of boiling water. Because shrimp don't take long to cook. In 10 minutes it's going to be ready. Yeah, so I'm adding a little bit of boiling water. And I'm going to cover it. As you know, seafood don't take long to cook. So I'll give it another five minutes for it to simmer down and then I'm sure it will be ready. I'm gonna just taste it here. Oh, it's perfectly fine. I'm gonna burst this pepper because I need it spicy. So I'm just gonna leave it to simmer down. I'll show you the finishing guys. Part. Here it is, it's all ready. I'm gonna turn it off now. It's all ready. I'm gonna put it on the plate and show you guys how it looks. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks.